Fairfax is a town of roughly six to 7,000 people. It has three bars that have live music seven nights per week, and that's more than anywhere else in Britain, virtually, in this tiny little place. Uh, well, the art scene and the party scene kind of overlap here, and they always have. I mean, you know, Paris in the 20s or whatever, you, New York in the 50s. And we always concentrate on the creative, artistic, weird, wacky, alcoholic, music-based. Obviously, the art scene is astonishing. We're going to talk to my mom, Laura Kimpton, via computer. Hi, Kylie. Hi. Uh, Fairfax is about nature. And uh, in Fairfax, we allow all things to happen, which I love. Um, what barn the yard animal would you like to photograph that you haven't yet? Well, there's rumor of some mini horses coming to Fairfax, and so that's what I'm hoping I get to photograph. I'd love to photograph a goose, too. Camp Artemis is a right brain playground. It's a gallery, it's a classroom, it's, a, it's bigger than just the store. My art is mainly about breaking free from mental boundaries of the way we need to live. And Fairfax is totally about breaking boundaries of the way we need to live. At the same time, living quite grounded. Everything Must Go is the name of the film, and it's a buddy picture. Um, it takes place in one day and uh, it's a short black comedy and uh, these two guys are on the hunt for something to hurt themselves with. What I've seen of this movie is very close to the impression that I have of what the director and the DP wanted to create. I uh, wrote the story and then I co-authored the script with uh, Mick Stern in New York, my writing partner of uh, 40 years, and then I produced and directed it. We allow the odd to be, because we're odd. You take it as the norm that you should be creating here. So there's a lot of people and you like know everybody in the town. Everybody that I know thinks that she's going to be an actor, so. Or a musician. Yeah. Fairfax really, really encourages people to live creatively. It's such a small town that when people come to visit me, they think I'm popular because I know everybody. But everybody knows everybody. Little by little, people are going to come into the Right Brain Playground and I'm going to teach them how to live in the Right Brain all the time. Probably half of everybody here is an artist, I suppose, either professionally or, or as a sideline. The world should watch Fairfax and every, if everybody acted like Fairfax, we'd live in a place that I would like to travel in. I'm very excited about Fairfax and art. I don't know if you can tell. <laughs> Well, I think art is a healthy activity. I think uh, it's uh, beneficial to people in many ways and uh, something the town should be proud of. What is a typical day for you? Tickling you. Hey, you want me to throw you in the pool? No. Here we go! Oh my god! <laughs> Don't drop your computer That's in the terrific. pool. Bye. Bye. I love you, darling. Call me tonight now that this works. Okay, bye. Okay, bye, Violet. Have a good day.